Friday. It's your girl, Brandy Kids. How you doing? It is a brand new day, brand new mercy. Y'all, I am so hungry. I want to stop and get me something to eat. But I did have to stop at TJ Maxx to take back that hoodie that I bought for my son and that jean shirt. If you follow me on my channel. Uh, yeah, they had to go back. And then I stopped at Home Goods, looking around, girl, buying stuff that I really, I don't need it, but it's all right. I'll show y'all when I get to the house. Sit y'all down. Get my sanitizer. I'm hungry. I haven't ate all day. You could just say I was on a little fast, but, um, we were to, my son was supposed to be with me, but he ended up having to, um, be at home because my son, my husband has a package that is coming. strawberry lemonade I'm going to try their Seagram lime drink it looks like something for Halloween or something but yeah I took back my son's um, sweatshirt because for one he ain't want it and for two I'm glad that my cousin should be watching she's like girl I think that man on there is Buddha I'm like oh no we don't represent Buddha while you're over here we, we, we represent Jesus nothing else It's your girl Brady Gibbs. I just came from Sam's Club and Walmart. So I picked up these uh, haagen from Sam's Club. We like these. So I'm going to put these away. So I've been out for a minute. And I bought my son some um, cinnamon toast crunch. He likes these. So I'm going to put these away. I found my next rings. I usually buy like the same thing all the time. When I went to Walmart, I needed some bread. I put all this stuff away. Um, I've never had these from Fridays. It's the chicken and rice. It says it's the famous cheesy spinach and artichoke sauce served with juicy chicken over perfectly cooked long rice. So if you had this before, let me know. These were the last two left and I grabbed them. So I figured they were probably some good. So we shall see. I picked up some cream, some sour cream for my baked potatoes some gum brought some lactate milk we needed dawn got that it was kind of cold today outside it wasn't as hot it was like 70. have you all tried the uh skippy natural with the honey it's pretty good it's like the creamy i like to make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches at night when i when i in need of a snack 
a little bit of Ortega sauces. I think we already have one, but I just got a small one just in case. Never heard of, I've heard of this brand, but I've never had it before. It's by Kinder's. It's the barbecue sauce in gold. And we love the Crofters uh, strawberry jelly. I got the Berry Harvest. And it's perfectly sweetened with fair trade cane sugar. Picked up some bananas and my Jimmy Dean's sausage. I really didn't want the pork, I really wanted the turkey. But oh well, it is what it is this time. We have the cranberry dragon fruit now. I want to try this out. I'm going to try it for you guys on camera. I love anything with dragon fruit. It just tastes so good. Some Listerine. Cheerios came out with the new fruity Cheerios, so you know we got to try that one in the family size. Some mini wheats, and my son loves mozzarella sticks, so I grabbed these for him. I got the small one. Some um, ground chunk for my tacos. I also went to um, Aldi's just to pick up some cherries because I wanted some cherries. Sam's Club didn't have it. They said that they were sold out. So um, here's some more milk. So you know I had to get my cherries. Um, these are the jumbo baking potatoes. And I smell them, make sure they're not rotten because sometimes they get rotten. So make sure you check your potatoes out. And they're pretty good. So we're gonna have to wash them and make us some potatoes. All right, then I picked up some more cranberry. I love these on my salad. I don't know, but my husband always goes through them. I got some more blue chips from all of these. Some J's. Some more cranberry. And this is like the three, the Mexican three cheese taco. I'm sorry, this is the Supremo Mexican three cheese. It has Chihuahua, Oaxaca, and Cotilla cheese. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. I think I am butchering it. And I got that, and I have my, my shells. El Milagro tortilla shells for the taco. And I didn't get one. I didn't get two, but I got three bags of cherries because we love them just that much. I picked up some Dove. This is the Summer Care. It, it smells like uh, grapefruit and lemon balm. It smells pretty good. I'm gonna use it at night when I take my bath. I don't know if I'm gonna like it, but I like the smell. I got that. And some And here's some more of the cranberry watermelon and this is the dragon fruit. So I got two of the dragon fruit, some lemonade, strawberry lemonade from um, Aldi's. I picked up some grapes as well. And my favorite, this is the Zest Free Sun Gold. These are the kiwi fruit. I picked up a box of um, tissue because I um, purchased something from TJ Maxx. I'll show y'all in a minute. Last but not least, some tater tots. So I'm gonna put this stuff away and I'll come back in one second. And the last item that I purchased from Walmart was this Sprite. Um, oh good. I was just looking around. I didn't just, nothing in particular that I was looking for. Just wanted to see what was really out. I picked up some pink. pink Himalayan salt and vinegar chips. I saw this cute t-shirt that says Nashville. I thought this was cute and it had like that little rhinestone. Well not rhinestone but kind of like the stud on the and it was outlined in like those silver studs which made it cute and it's gray. I love gray. Gray is my favorite. And my receipt. And then I picked up these flowers. They were on clearance from Martha Stewart. I figured I'd put them in here. Let's see how they're gonna look. I always 
got to get some junk. And I saw these cherry slices. And they are good. I was munching on them in the car. And the last item I got was this matte, um, this matte, this matte tissue box holder. That's why I got the tissue box. I put it in here. like that and I'll probably put this in the living room somewhere um and on my way home I stopped at Ross because I was looking for something and I figured we needed another mat for our house <laughs> and so I got this I always you know the, the mats kind of wear out so you have to continue buying them this was only $8.99 and they had some pretty colors I love the colors and the last thing that I purchased is this rug I thought this was nice too girl yeah so I want to replace the one in the living room because it's like cream and cream gets dirty really really fast and these have some really nice colors in it that matches the living room so I ended up getting this one it wasn't it was real reasonable you know Ross be reasonable child so yep your girl got another rug and I'm done so I am about to taste this chicken and rice. I'm gonna try the chicken and rice along with my dragon fruit cranberry and I'm gonna let y'all know what I think. So let me put this over here to the side. And so I decided to put it down. All right, I'll be back. So let me try this. It's supposed to be good, I don't wanna see. And then, you know, I'm not a fan of heating stuff in a microwave. It just seems weird. But, girl's like sold out. What's that about? Let's bless this food. It looks like, it looks like something my dog would eat. Okay, let me show y'all. <laughs> it ain't looking that delicious, y'all. Let's see. So what is in here? So it is from Fridays. I guess they serve it. It's diced white meat, grilled chicken, and spinach artichoke sauce over long grain rice. Try a bless this food, Father God. I'm about to receive in Jesus' name. I pray, man. It is good. And you can take this to work, but you can just put it in the microwave. You don't got to put it in the oven. It's good, y'all. I'll give it a nine out of 10. Okay, and then we're gonna try this Ocean Spray Cranberry and Dragon Fruit. Cause earlier, I ain't gonna even lie to you. That Wendy's Seagram's lime is nasty. My smoothie, the pineapple, strawberry metabolism energy boost or whatever that was nasty it wasn't nasty i gave it a five out of five but that lime from serums is a two out of ten i taste more cranberry than i do dragon fruit but it's still good i would repurchase it so i'm gonna get off of here y'all because i did damage today I'm putting y'all here. I'll see y'all later. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Brandy Giz. I am back with an interruption. I wanted to share with you all something super, super exciting from my friends over at Faith Keep Biz. They reached out. They wanted me to share with you all some exciting pieces. So, of course, I obliged. And I'm going to share with you all what they sent me. So, we're going to get started and these are if you want to buy on the budget but you don't want to spend a lot of money on you know cute items that are really nice and trendy you can shop on over on their website they have really nice items for a reasonable cost so yes this floats your boat going over to their website so i'm going to show you what is in this first box let's open it up and it comes with um 
So it actually comes in like plastic. Okay, so the first item is in this simplistic dust bag. It just says Gucci on it there. And I'm gonna take it out. And it is a cute little maroon crossbody with the Gucci colors, the green and red. So I'm gonna take this plastic off. I don't have my scissors. I'm gonna take this plastic off and I'll come right back. All right, beauty, so here is a really nice crossbody. I love it. It has the gold chain and then it goes into like the leather strap for your shoulders. And it is a cute little circular bag. I'm gonna bring it in so that you guys can see how it looks. It's really cute and it looks like it has, um, you know, your necessities. You have your little Gucci, your Gigi on the zipper part and inside, so then we have this stuffing inside. And what else we have up in here? So then you have that little card. Some items to keep it. Okay, so inside this bag is like a really cute little small bag and it just has Gucci on the tag, but there aren't any um, pockets or anything. It's just just the open bag. It is really, really cute. I'm gonna put it on so that you can see how it'll look. And it'll look something like so. This would be cute to wear anywhere, to church, on a, like a boat cruise, um, on vacation, wherever the case may be, you can wear this, you can wear this actually to work. But like when I'm going to work, I don't know, for some reason I always take more than what I should. But this bag is just so cute because it's like on the go. It does fit like a cell phone. So you don't have to worry about that. It also fits like, hold on. Yeah, so when I'm like going to work, I need like a sack to put my stuff in. So um, it does fit. It does fit a cell phone and your wallet. Some lip gloss and close it up I love it I love the chains on here it is super cute and yeah girl you are good to go so this is again how it looks on really really cute I love it and we are gonna move on to the next item that was sent okay the next item that was sent is in this box and it comes in a dust cloth like so and I chose I've been telling y'all for the longest I chose the um i call it the cosmetic bag and it's in the easy i think this is the damier print it's the brown dark brown light brown print it is so nice i love it um i used to have one of these but it was a little bit smaller i thought i was ordering the smaller one so if i do carry some makeup in this bag it will have to probably fit into one of the one of the bigger bags that I have but yeah inside it has that red and you don't have to worry about like the inside getting dirty because you kind of like wipe it off and it has like different not compartments but pockets to place items in but it is really nice because I have like a lot of lipstick and lip gloss and um, lip liners just in my purse at the bottom but this right here will work for me, honey. Remember I've been telling y'all I've been wanting a, um, I've been wanting a cosmetic bag for the longest, but something kind of like cute. And this is how the inside looks. And you can kind of wipe it, wipe it off. It's kind of like that, like nylon type of material. But yes, here it is. It is really nice. And it comes with the zipper. Let me take the plastic off, I'm so excited. So yeah, it comes with the zipper. And I love it. So it'll fit in your purse to work. So I'll just probably put that in here and it'll work for me. Yes. So I love it. And the last item that they sent me was in this box right here. It's the MCM box. And I wanted a different kind of wallet. So this is the dust bag plastic. And I don't have an MCM. I have an MCM purse, but it's like the 
it's the brown the, the the brown one or the it's like the neutral tone one but this one is pink you guys know i love my pink so when i'm running on some errands taking my son to school whatever the case may be i just take this with me but this is their wallet and inside you open it up and you have like your credit card slots your id window you have a lot of credit card slots you have one two three four five six. about six credit card slots one two three four five six seven eight nine so you have about nine credit card slots and then you have some other slots on this side as well on the inside you have your zipper compartment if you want to put some like i have a chain that i have in my purse the necklace that i usually wear i have that in my purse i need to probably transfer it but i like this wallet and then you can also keep your cash i'm taking all this paper out then you can also keep your cash inside like right here so that is cool Yes, I like this wallet. It's cute. It'll work. Yes, so I love the color pink and the quality is really nice. But we will see how it holds up eventually. I want to thank Faith Keep Biz for reaching out and sending me these products to share with you all. I like stuff like this. And with that being said, you guys, I am about to end this here video. And with that being said, you guys, let's move on to the vlog. Ooh, y'all, it is super hot outside. So I just switched over to my camera. I don't usually take my camera out because it's just a hassle. I don't have anything for the camera to hold on to. So, um, I had just left the mall. I needed to pick up some. Let me make sure. I need to pick up some birthday cards. I have a lot of birthdays this month. And I needed some cute little cards. I like to buy cute little cards. Um, they're cheaper at Marshalls or TJ Maxx than it is at like um Walgreens, CVS, places like that. Ooh that be pulling you back but uh yeah girl so i went to marshall's and i found something that i was looking for and i'm glad i went there because i went to two other marshall's near the house and i couldn't find anything so girl i got y'all propped up in a box a tissue box so today is a great day i, I don't want to spend too much time outside i'm trying to hurry up back home i need to just stop and purchase some balloons today is my son's birthday he is sweet 16 y'all uh, i woke up early this morning my husband already gave him um the the gift that he really wanted and um i purchased him um a gift outside of the gift that my husband got him and i also put some money on his credit card or his debit card rather I'm hungry. I didn't even eat anything. And they have food at the house, but I just want to go out and pick up a card. Um, my son is one of those kids that don't ask for nothing. He's not a beggar. He's not like uh, try to break you or anything. He's just a, uh, just a sweet soul. Jordans he's just real laid back don't don't want none but a belly full of food and play his game he goes to school and he good he gets good grades so I'm just thankful I'm gonna give me a lemonade Ooh, it's hot. so I don't mind doing things for him and his dad doesn't mind because he don't ask he don't even really 
like if I'm going to the store, he don't ask me for anything. He'll just say, just bring me something back to eat. So I wasn't that kind of kid. I wanted the best, okay? I my son's not really into like clothing and stuff like that. Like some kids are. He's not into the clothing and the the shoes. He's just he ain't get it from his mama. Cause honey, I had my daddy when it was about the about oh, let me get over here. Let me oh, hey hold on. Let me order my um see if they got a, a lemonade. Ooh. Hey. Yeah. Can I do you have strawberry lemonade? Uh, I do. Okay, I'll get a large. Go. Um and a small fry. Let me pull up my app. That's all for now. Uh, yeah, I'll get the chip Chipotle. Uh, That's all. Order? It's Brandy. I'm trying to pull up y'all app. 664 for you today. Okay. You know, sir? Thank you. Oh, yeah. You too. Yeah, I just want something real quick, y'all. It's hot out here. Let me turn on the air. I'm just sweating. It's not extremely hot, but it's like, ooh. Air condition. Okay. Girl, what am I doing? Okay. Yep, so my baby is 16 years old, girl, and I was just thanking God because this time, 16 years ago, girl, I was in giving birth to him. I had um, gave birth to him vaginally. I didn't have a cesarean or anything like that, girl, and I was in labor. I don't know how many hours I was in, but I, I remember going the day before. I can't even remember. I know it was on, I believe it's on a Tuesday, if I'm not mistaken. Hey, what are they doing over here? They got some kind of contraption. Um, I don't like this. The world, girl, I'm suing them. They, they got some kind of uh, contraption making me sweat. Girl, I'm sweating all up in the back of my head, child. What the heck? Yeah. Okay. Can I get a cup of water? Of course. Thank you. Thank you, sir. My pleasure. All right. Oh, no, I ain't coming back over here until they get they uh until they get it right. They're trying to fix it and keep the driveway open. They should keep. They should close it up and get it fixed. They have this contraption where you drive over it, but it's open under the bottom. You can see actually under the bottom. Anyway, so yes, girl, my son. I was in labor. I remember going in on. I want to say. I want to say I went on a Saturday night. To get induced because I didn't go into labor or anything my mortar didn't break and I think it was like on a Saturday night and I didn't have them Sunday until Sunday going into my girl I don't know all I know all I remember is yep I had him he came really quick a few pushes he was out my aunt Cheryl was there my husband was there my mother was there I think my father was there he probably was he wasn't in the room but my, my aunt was in the room and my um, husband was in the room those two yeah when I um, had a mirror so that was special that was really special my auntie Cheryl the one y'all seen on the last vlog I got a cup of water because sometimes they lemonade can be a bit sweet but yep so my baby is sweet 16 I ain't throwing no parties or anything he just he's just not that kid so uh, yes I'm just excited 
excited, girl. I'm excited for the boy. So wish my baby a happy birthday. Okay. And I'm gonna bless this food that I'm about to receive. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Eat one of these fries and I was listening to some Joshua Giles. He was preaching a little bit. But now I'm about to listen to, of course, some gospel. Because that's all I, somebody say, that's all you ever listen to, girl? It's like every blue moon. And I mean, when the moon is blue, well, I listen to secular music. So I like to listen to worship because I love the Lord and I, I was created to worship. Um, every now and then I see a, like a love song that reminds me of uh, something. I'm not in the car listening to no rap. And the rap now, mm-mm, mm-mm, that'll drive me bananas. The rap that the, the kids listen to today. My son don't even listen to it. He basically listens to some gaming music. I ain't gonna be listening to all that craziness. And then, shoot, when you get over 40, you don't be wanna listen to all that noise. Some people do, but I can't take it. It just messes with my nerves. Like, ugh, okay, that's enough. You know, too much noise is not a good, good, good for me. Mm -mm. I like this song. I think it's by, it's by Kanye. More than anything, it's the choir. Let me turn it up a little bit. Yeah. Ooh, -wee. Ooh this light is. What's up, y'all? It's your girl. I'm back, and I just finished running some errands. Now my eyes want to run, but um, I went and picked up some balloons from the Dollar Tree because my son he ain't really probably at the he's probably at that age where he don't care about balloons. But I've been doing it since he's been born. Every year, I love to give balloons to people for some reason. But anyway, girl, I went to Party City. So I went to Party City and I got a, a one and a six. And the lady said $33 or $35. I'm like, for what? She said the, the two balloons. I will not, not I. I don't care if he's 16. You gotta be responsible with your money. So I was like, you know what? No, thank you. I'm sorry about that. And I walked out the store. I went straight to Dollar Tree across the street and I got the same balloon, but it's in a, a, a gold color, but that's okay. For five dollars. Mm-hmm. Five dollars. And I just got some other balloons. I wanted some clear balloons. I just think it looks pretty and it's just it just makes you feel good on your, your birthday. At least I know it feels good when I get balloons. And um, yeah, I wanted to get my baby some balloons. So I would went to um so I went to Dollar Tree. And I picked them up. Yep. Until he tells me, Ma, I don't want no more balloons. Then I stop buying balloons. But I love, I love balloons. I love to receive roses. I won't give him no roses, but I love to receive roses. I love flowers, stuff like that. That's just my love language. But anyway, um, I just hit up a lot of stores. I just didn't report because there's just so much going on. I ain't feel like taking that camera. So I'm on my way to pick up his cake and then I'm headed home. Yes. I don't think we're going out to eat today, but my husband did order food, so we have food at home. So I'm trying to hurry up and pick up the dessert so that he can so we can celebrate, okay? Alright, I'll see y'all in a minute. Let me hit this bakery up. Bye. <clears throat> Beauties, what is up? It's another day, y'all. And I just left Bible study, noonday Bible study. I was able to attend. It was really good. Uh, the service was um, awesome. I'm 
learning a lot y'all I always tell you guys about um, what we've learned it was awesome um, my pastor she taught noonday Bible study I like to go to noonday when I'm off because um, you can get it out the way and you still have your whole your, your whole day left but for me on some Tuesdays I work so I'll have to go to the evening portion so she's just speaking upon um, well she is teaching on the supernatural and her title for Sunday service was I'm moving into the supernatural which is really really good so what I'm gonna do right now is I was hungry and I was gonna go to Olive Garden but something said you know what go to Trader Joe's because you love their fettuccine Alfredo and make it yourself so that's what I am going to do go to Trader Joe's really quick and make my own fettuccine Alfredo I'll probably make some corn on the cob and maybe or some broccoli some fettuccine alfredo i like um garlic sticks so i don't know we'll see i'm gonna buy some garlic sticks probably from um walmart so yeah that's what i plan on doing today it is a beautiful day the sun is shining and i just feel great so i'm going to listen to some music on my way to trader joe's and plus they got my favorite drinks um they have my favorite drinks and that's what i like to grab which are the red blood i think it's called red blood sparkling soda something like that anyway i wanted to go and get my nails done i hate my nails i told y'all this in the last vlog i don't hate my nails i shouldn't say that because that's a harsh word but i dislike my nails so i'm gonna keep them on but i want to get them short I really do. I want to get them short. I wonder is my nail tech um, busy. I want to change them. But I can go. I can go until the next Saturday. So. Alright girl. I'm rambling. Let me go to Trader Joe's. And I'll see you guys when I get there. And I might just show y'all what I. um What I purchased. Alright let me go. Just turned on water hose. Well, not the hose, but the sprinkler system. And I got wet, so don't mind this, okay? But I wanted to come to you and share with you all my Trader Joe's. Oh, y'all. I got everything but the cookie butter. The cookie butter. Yeah, I got everything but the cookie butter. I can't remember what it is. It's a spread. It's some kind of, you could dip your fruit and whatnot in it. Or maybe your cookies. I don't know, but they're out of that so I got the organic yellow chips I picked up some organic raisin bran this is with the clusters cereal I'm gonna make some fettuccine alfredo because I'm hungry and I'm gonna throw in some bread sticks with it these are the garlic and cheese bread sticks so I'm gonna make that in a few minutes I got some spinach dip for my husband and I got the buffalo chicken dip for myself Okay, we're gonna try the butter chicken and basmati rice. Never had this before, but it's pretty good. I'm gonna see how it turns out for me. I got the uncured apple smoke bacon. Now they said put this on your your um, eggs. It's the everything, but Eloy is a seasoning blend. They said it's good on your eggs, so I'm gonna try it. Of course, I had to get some fresh strawberry jam. No, actually, this is the preserve. And then we have the mandarin orange chicken bake and serve. I had this before, it's pretty good. I only got three bags. And usually my total at Trader Joe's is really cheap or inexpensive. But this time, it was $115. I got the organic white chips because I have some cheese. I got a little bitty personalized cheese that I can put on my um, chips. 
then I bought this, this fettuccine alfredo so I saved because I would have spent $40 at Olive Garden but I'm gonna make it myself so I got two the cashier said these Dutch griddle cakes are divine so I had to try and make look like that so you know we have to get that right I got some tres leche cake I don't know why I got that cake when we have birthday cake for my son's birthday but I'll put that in the freezer I'm gonna, I'm gonna share the uh, birthday cake with my parents uh, the mango cream bars yes here's another chicken tikka masala I think they're different and I love me some tempura, tempura shrimp picked up the medium shrimp as well to go in my alfredo got my husband some meatless breakfast sausages and i'm gonna make this broccoli right now so that is the second bag and the third bag girl y'all i'm sweating up a storm i am sweating it is hot outside and i love it i love it I wanted to get braids. I should have just went ahead and put my appointment to get some braids because y'all know it's hot out here. Okay, I got four of these. This is the blood. This is what I went to the store for. And it's the Italian blood orange soda. It is so good, y'all. The last one that I had in bust. So I'm just gonna put the rest on the floor. I don't know, I hit my my um when I got in the car, I hit my ear and my earring this one right here the hermes earring don't look too close girl because my makeup is just jacked up but it's the hermes earring i like them because they're pink i love the color pink but uh the back came off blue in a car i can't find the other hermes earring so i just stopped at tj maxx really quick to get me some cute little i like studded earrings so I saw these. They're like the butterfly and they're cubic zirconi. I got these. Cute little butterfly, but they're gold. I usually like silver earrings. I'm a silver girl. So I ended up getting that. I saw a few that I liked, but I was like, girl, what are you doing? And this is this will be my everyday earring right here. These right here. Yeah. So I have one, two, I have two holes and I have, I have one up here, but I don't usually put an earring in there. But yeah, these are the earrings that I'll be wearing every day. And then I've seen this, this top. They always have like a jean top or something. I've seen this top, I got it in the large. And I don't know, I like the sleeves of it and how it's made. It looks like that cow grew material. Let me see if I can fit it. Oh, so these are actual buttons. I thought these snapped. I, mean, I was out there watering these little flowers that I got, the little flowers that I have because I didn't do too much this year. Okay, so. Yeah, it'll fit. It'll feel uncomfortable and everything. I like how the arms are. They're not too tight. Oh, yeah, this will be cute to wear. To, uh, I can actually wear this to work too. All right, so let me go cook because I'm hungry. All right, beauty. So this is my meal. Let me show y'all. This is my meal, my fettuccine alfredo with shrimp. And I have my broccoli. And my cheese garlic bread. And my cheese garlic bread. And I have my drink. I'm about to jump in the shower, eat my food. I'm gonna eat my food, jump in the shower, take this off because I'm hot and sweaty. And I'll see you. And I'll see you in the next one. Until then, have a blessed one. Bye, y'all.